I would like to begin by congratulating all the ISRO scientists and all those people who work behind the success of Sindrayan. It's a proud moment for all of us as Indians, especially for our students, the future citizens of this country and the leaders of this country. What we say is it's a victory for humanity. Did you know that after, after India's independence, a lot of foreign experts and the political experts, they were really skeptical that India would never stay united or would never be able to lead itself. But we have proved them wrong for 76 years now and we will still do that. And also Modi ji shared a few important words. I would like to emphasize it. I am not sure about the exact Hindi words. But he said something like, Aaj ke bache kehte hai ki sandh maa dur hai. Which translates to, Today's children say that the moon is really far. But kal ke bache kehenge ki sandh maa aspati hai. Which means, Tomorrow's children will say that the moon is really close to us. It's such an example for all of us to achieve great things in life. And it's also a huge inspiration for all of us. So tomorrow when you sing your national anthem, be a little louder. Thank you, Om Namah Shivaya. Om Namah Shivaya, Mamateshwari Namaha. So we are all aware of our country's success. Our country has achieved something that even many other countries tried but they couldn't. So it is a very proud moment for all of us. And I am really proud to say that my own uncle, Jai Kumar, was a part of the team. He has been working in SNO for a long time but I was not uh, aware of the importance of that. But the moment uh, I heard about the, uh, our country's success, I was really proud that he is a part of the team. Even my dad who has never cried in front of me, even he had a few tears in his eyes. So that made me realize uh, the importance and the uh, vitality of our country's success. I hope for uh, more such achievements by our country. Thank you, Om Oh, Om Namah Shivaya, I am Prashari Bhavik of Class 12A. So yesterday, we scripted history in our country. Chandraya 3 landed on the south pole of the moon and we were the first country to ever land on the south pole of the moon. And that's something very proud. It's a very proud moment for all of us Indians. And it's something, it's a proud moment for our humanity as well. Something what our Prime Minister Narendra Modi ji told yesterday while addressing the nation from Johannesburg. So, a moon mission is not something which happens in just days. It took four years and the amount of intricacy and hard work which goes into making something so beautiful and something which it is the culmination of the hard work of more than thousands of people who have worked for it. Scientists from different fields, physicists, astrophysicists, geophysicists, mathematicians, mechanical engineers, structural engineers, aerospace engineers, and so many other people, those who have worked hard, those who have toiled every day for the past four years, those who have just thought of Chandrayaan 3. And that is why we have been able to land on it. And it's such an auspicious moment that we should remember Dr. Vikram Sarabhai, the pioneer of Indian space program. He envisaged the space program of India when India was an impoverished country. But now we are what we were meant to be. We are one of the greatest nations with the most efficient space organization in the world. And that makes me feel proud as an Indian. Jai Him. Om Namah Shivaya. It was a very proud moment yesterday because we reached the south pole of the moon, which no other country has done. So we remember the day when uh, ABJ Abdul Kalam transported the first rocket in cycle, but now we have reached the moon. It is a big difference in what we started and what we have ended. So it was a, uh, the Chandrayaan 3 was actually planned to be launched on 2019, but it was delayed by four years. In all these four years, the scientists lived, breathed and slept thinking about the Chandrayaan 3. It is their effort and our country's support which has helped us to achieve this. So we should know that it is our responsibility to do something to the country. So I would like to end up that the moon, the, the Chandrayaan 3 
has lighted up the darker side of the moon and it is a very proud moment. The Vikram's message was that the, it has reached the moon but it is our, it is our thing we have to reach our destination. Thank you, Om Om Namah Shivaya, Vamitya Shiva Namaha. I am SK Ashwagan of class 12th year. Here to share about some the points about the Sandrayan 3. It, uh, yesterday at 6.04 p.m. Sandrayan has landed soft landing. Uh, it is a, English, a great moment for all the Indians. Uh, uh, it is one of the most the proudest moment in our country. Uh, in 1960s, uh, we used to take the satellites in cycle. As uh, Swati mentioned, uh, we used to take satellites and cycle, but uh, within 50 to 50 years, we have developed so so many. So it is a very indeed proud moment, and we have taken uh, taken over all the most important space organizations such as NASA and uh, European uh, Union uh, Space Research, uh, etc. And uh, as Brazil has said, uh, science and spirituality uh, combined. So before. Uh, uh, the launch, before the launch and after the launch of Chandrayaan 3, our uh, ISRO chairman, S. Somnath, also met uh, our uh, Mata Amaradana for, uh, for, for and uh, also got uh, uh, blessings from Mama. And uh, it is a very indeed uh, a great moment. And uh, 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 the project manager, uh, uh, Mr. M. Sankaran, I was hearing his speech. Uh,